<laughs> hey, that's me, a 24-year-old Madison, Wisconsin realtor who just bought his first home. Guys, I just bought a freaking house. Join me as I show the highs and lows of owning a home and the true cost of renos on a starter home in my market. This is Down to the Studs. Okay, day three at the house. We're not super excited as we have been the past couple days, but gonna show you guys what we did all yesterday and we got some more painting today. And yeah, just keep working today. Here's the carnage in the garage. Definitely gotta clean that up at some point. Today we're painting the living room walls, starting all the ceilings, finished painting the doors. This is just primer on the doors. So definitely a mess in here. But we got all the doors and trim done for the priming. About half the walls are painted with at least one coat. We'll start the bathroom today. Touch up paints in these rooms. Another day, another Home Depot trip for, you guessed it, some more paint. Let's go get it. Okay, midway through the day, we got pretty much all the rooms painted, ceiling, walls. Um, about to do the hallway ceiling and we got some more help coming. We have former painting extraordinaire Oliver here. Look at, he's got paint on his cheek. That's how pro he is. <laughs> he is painting the kitchen for us. I love the title. <laughs> <laughs> Retired painter extraordinaire. My sister's doing trim again. I think you were here last time I was recording. You're doing the same part. That's how long it takes. Where's Addie? Oh, she's up in the crevices painting what will be the pantry. And uh, I don't know where mom is, but that's the update. Day four, we are finishing up, just touching up painting. Um, we were able to get at least one coat on every wall or ceiling. So the goal is to completely finish painting today, clean up so that the flooring guy will have a clean space for tomorrow. Um, I've had, I don't want to see another paintbrush for the rest of my life. It is tiring. I'm sore, but this is what I signed up for. So, um, time for another day and I'm excited for when the flooring actually gets put in, but I'm going to show you guys what all the work we've done so far.
Nothing like a tradesman's dinner. Mm. Almost done. Oh. <laughs> Just the lower half of these walls left. And then done painting, hopefully. Painting is done. Flooring is going to be at least started tomorrow morning around 9.30 have an asbestos guy, even though we've already chopped up some of the walls, he's coming tomorrow as well. Um, but that will be in the next video, but we are finally done painting, sore and all, but finally can relax for a little bit. We are about to go light fixture shopping, which will be super fun, maybe, hopefully, and get a shop vac. It's not a Henry, which has like, I'll put a picture somewhere, but that's my go-to dream shop vac, but it's $400. I say I'll, I can put googly eyes on a cheaper vacuum. It's not the same. It's not a Henry. But this one's 50 bucks versus 400 so it's worth it. Just did a quick shop vac deal. A little drug deal right there. It's no Henry, but I'm going to do a GoFundMe for a Henry. So if you want to support that in my dream of getting a Henry, please do. This is by far the best section in any store. This Beckford one is the one that we're choosing. Now we just gotta find it. One at the top is our new front door light. For the two other bedrooms, we're doing this one in brushed, what is it? Oil rubbed bronze. What about this one? What about this one? We got about half our lights and we'll finish the rest um, online ordering and we're gonna order a couple other things online too. That'll do it for this episode of Down to the Studs. If you're liking this series, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you need help buying your first home anywhere in the nation, anywhere in the world, be sure to hit me up and subscribe to this channel. But until then, I will see you guys in the next episode of Down to the Studs.